the Trailblazers and the T-Wolves is going head-to-head. -head. We're seeing a big line here with a Minnesota favorite 14. We see the total coming at 211.5. The Portland is just 2-9 and nine in their last 11 games, and the only two wins were to a, a Memphis team that seems all too happy um, to lose games right now, especially to a team that is ahead of them as far as the ping pong race. Um, Minnesota is on a back-to-back -back third game in four nights. They've now lost two consecutive close games to Western Conference teams and dropped into second place in the West behind OKC. There's no doubt that Minnesota wins this game at home where they're 22-7 and seven straight up this season. Even it doesn't even matter that it's that it's the second game of a back to back to me. They should be motivated in a bounce back spot. The way that I would play this, however, would be to take Minnesota in the first half to just to avoid maybe having some tired legs um, on the back to back or which I, I don't think this will happen, but you still avoid it with the first half is maybe them taking their foot off the gas. All right, uh, Joe Sos here. Uh, like uh, we have talked to the earlier here, T Wolves was the lean at 14, but his best play, play is the first half uh, with the T Wolves in this one. But if you had to pick a side, it would be the T Wolves laying the points, but his best play would be the first half on Minnesota Timberwolves. All right, let's continue on here on the NBA rundown. 